Wow. Just bear with me, guys, okay? Tyler, in a few short hours, you'll be my husband. And how lucky I am to say that, I get to share the rest of my life with you. You're the greatest person I ever met. And growing up with you the last 10 years has been the biggest blessing. I cannot begin to explain to you how excited I am to be able to, to be called your wife. And even more, spend the rest of my days with you. I love you endlessly and eternally, and I can't, cannot wait to see you at the end of the aisle today. Love your bride, Miss Chloe Cairns. <laughs> it was beautiful, man. It was beautiful. It makes me wonder if mine was good enough now. <laughs> Chloe and Tyler have made their vows to each other in our presence and have confirmed their promises by the joining of hands and the exchange of rings. And therefore, by the authority given by this province, I pronounce, they are now husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride. Growing up, you know, being a boy, wanting, really wanting a brother, can ultimately say you're one of my best pals. Being able to talk to him about absolutely anything. I love you, man. Thank you. Welcome to the family. But growing up, you know, there's this illusion that brothers and sisters fight, especially in their teen years. I'm glad to say that's never been the case with Chloe and I. Wholeheartedly, I can say that Chloe has been one of the most influential people in my life. And I'm so lucky to have a big sister like you. Chloe, I love you. You look beautiful today. And I love that, you know, you're my big sister, but obviously you're one of my best friends in the world.